Luke? Can you hear me? It's only one Kenobi. Only one. Yes, of course you can hear me. How are you doing? Uh, I'm going to do something now that I have never done before, and I never thought I'd do one of these. Uh, but everyone else seems to do them. It's a bit of a haul video. Today is Force Friday of September the 1st, 2017. Um, if you're new to my channel, the only reason I set up a channel in the first place on YouTube was because I, I had something to say uh, about one, one topic, which is the vintage collection. As you can see, I'm a vintage collection collector. Loose and carded, carded stuff behind. But um, I wanted to talk about what we're going to get next year and sort of speculate. But um, since I've got this channel and I've got a few subscribers now, I thought I would do a little haul video because I've been out today for Force Friday and I've, I'm quite happy with what I've got. I'm going to show you the seven items that I've received. Um, I only really wanted two, and I'm really pleased to say that I got them, and that was the Luke Skywalker, and that was the Kylo Ren, the new Kylo Ren, in 3.75. I'm a big 3.75 fan. <clears throat> Let's show you them, so I'm pleased to say that I got them. There's Luke there. I'm not going to be keeping these carded. The only things I keep carded are really the vintage collection stuff, but these will be coming out of the packet. I can't wait to have that on display at some point. And also, uh, yep. And uh, this Kylo Ren here. And I'm a big fan of this figure. It looks great because you can see he's wearing that Vader style cloak. And the reason I really like that is because I'm a really big fan. And I'm going to do a video about it. This figure here. This is one of my favourite figures of all time. It's a concept art Anakin Skywalker. So he didn't quite look like that in the end in the, in the um, Revenge of the Sith. But it sort of like screams Vader doesn't it. Because he's got a black flowing cloak. And he, it's a great figure that by the way. I'll do a review on that I promise. So that was a good start. Got these two in the bag. But when I was in Toys R Us and they had so much there, um, I thought I'd get a few other items, including this Poe Dameron here. Now, the reason I got this was because I don't have a Poe with a remo removable helmet. Um, and basically... Sorry, someone's trying to call me. I'll get rid of that. <sighs> trying to do... A, it's my mate, Michael. Stop calling me, Michael. I'm trying to do a video. The reason I got this is because they did have a... Um, fully articulated Poe in the Black Series with a removable helmet. I never got that, so this is a, a welcome addition to my collection. Fantastic. Moving on, what else did I get? I thought I'd get Ray as well. It looks pretty good, because I think they had a Ray from the end of The Force Awakens that was the wrong colour. Sith Lord 229 picked up on that as well. It was a great figure, but she had the wrong colour top, but that's at least correct now. Nice. If you're a geek like myself and him, who know these things. And finally, I got this. Now, I was thinking to myself, why did I get this? Because in my roof, I've got about th five First Order Stormtroopers unopened that I got for three quid each at Home Bargain. Home Bargain's like a shop in the UK, if you're an American person watching this. Um, but I've actually had a closer look, and I think he might have a bit of wrist... Not wrist waist articulation so i might open him and see what i've got but i thought to myself why have i bought him you know i've got tons of these fellas but you can never have too many army building you know what i mean and all of that but anyway um and the last figure is for my mate michael the guy was just calling me now for god's sake mark i'm doing a bloody video here and he, re he i spoke to him and i said been, i've been down there and i said i didn't get the page and he said why didn't you get page it's a great figure well then i went out to my local tesco's didn't i michael went to a tesco's extra and guess what they had the teal wave on the shelves there so i have got page and yeah i can't believe i didn't get her earlier because she does look great i do like collecting pilots and a lovely removable helmet it. and then the last thing i got today which i could not get because if you are someone who is a six inch collector and the 40th anniversary wave there's been horrendous problems with that in fact i've actually cancelled my order with someone online i won't say who um but um i'm glad that i found this today because i've got the entire wave one of the 40th anniversary vintage uh, not vintage you know the 40th anniversary uh, six inch figures and this was one that I really wanted because I've got them all on display on the stand that you get because when you buy the Vader you get the display stand with all the pegs on and you get the what you call it now it's the kind of early bird certificate background isn't it so it's quite nice I've got it in the other room there but it would have been nice if I'd had the rest of the wave two to go with the wave one but one of the figures from the wave two that I really wanted was this stormtrooper so I'm glad to have picked that up today I saw it on the shelf and I thought I've got to get that so there you go so I've spent quite a bit of money today but I think it's all been worth it, hasn't it? This has been Only One Kenobi with the first ever haul video ever on this channel. I hope you've enjoyed it. Have you enjoyed Force Friday 2? Let me know in the comment box. This has been Only One Kenobi. Only One. Out.